Anyway, when I couldn't pinpoint the exact location of my humble summer cottage in the Hamptons, she dropped me right there. Cold. Damn, I look like an idiot still holding the drinks I'd been paying for all night. It is fortunate that you found me. Quickly, this way. Perfect! He won't trouble us anymore! Hurry! We mustn't linger here! More soldiers! Shoot them! See those soldiers down there? We are not as well supplied as the enemy, so we'll have to improvise. Aim at the fuel barrels rather than the soldiers. You're wounded! Take that medical kit behind the ambulance! Good! You are ready for battle again. We're not out of the woods yet. It's us or them. He's wounded! Here, take this. You have a health pack. Save this man's life. Yo, that was close. I guess I owe you one pal. What's our status? Okay, come with me, guys. I've got supplies that'll get us out of this mess. Grab a Molotov. Let's show the Reds! Babies! Oh. oh yeah, baby! Steve Reich and he's out! No time to waste. They'll be back if we don't hurry. Open this manhole with your wrench. Citizens of New York and comrades from the Soviet Armed Forces, welcome to our first news broadcast after today's events. My name is Tatiana Kempinski, and I will be your regular news anchor from now on. We hope in time to obtain the cooperation of most of your familiar TV personalities once they return from a re-education program at our training facilities in Alaska. Meanwhile, I will make sure you get all necessary information about our efforts to restore peace and stability in your troubled country. Our Soviet leaders have been concerned for years by the plight of the poor American people suffering under a corrupt regime. Today